Good morning. We are heading out. Oh my goodness. To vacation. To vacation, yep. Uh -huh. See you in Taipei. See you in Taipei. Playing while waiting for Tian to check in. <laughs> wow. This girl is going to the airport like a pro. Yeah, you guys, we are hungry. We're gonna go into a lounge. Okay, you guys, I we just got to the lounge and I'm gonna go get some food. I'm hungry. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit, okay? Summer, take this. It's okay, Saisha. It's okay. Which cheese do you like? Huh? It's annoying for us. What? Yes. Okay, you want this? You don't want cheese with it? Yeah. No? Okay. They have hummus. Want hummus? Hummus. It's like beans. Ooh, the ribs looks delicious. Here, give me a plate closer. Yeah. Oh, this is special mac and cheese. Just a little bit, okay? Uh, can I just get a beer? Yeah, just light, sure. this light one. Where are you guys going? Uh, Taipei. Oh, beautiful destination. Yeah. <laughs> right, Thank you so much. You're welcome. Eat it. I know. Good? Where's my fork? Is it good? Yeah. Oh, it looks good. This is what AB got. The rib looks really good. Try the rib, babe. I want to eat mac and cheese. Oh, eat mac and cheese then. They have tons. Tons of mac and cheese. All right, let me show you what I got. So this is my lunch. Got some salami, watermelon, some grilled squash, ribs, pepper, got some chowder, and a beer. <laughs> Hi, me. Hi, me. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna eat a little bit first and then uh, we will talk, okay? Because I'm hungry. So hey you guys, welcome back. If you are new, hello. Uh, my name is Fong. That is Tian, honey wave. <laughs> and then you got Mila, Avery, and Xander. And we are just your typical family of five in Seattle. Um, we love to travel. We started to travel when Xander was, I think, six months old. And he is nine right now, turning 10 in August. So you do, you do the math. We've been traveling for quite some time now. Last year, we started to take our kids to um, Southeast Asia and we loved it. So this year, we're going back, you guys. We are going back. <laughs> so we are so excited. Um, so since, since um, we started vlogging last year, we got a lot of questions. I mean, since we started traveling and vlogging, I get a lot of question from my friends and people that I know well how do you afford to travel with five kids well there's some budgeting and there's um, you know we does a lot of um, coin system that we use so anyways on this trip we are going to show you exactly how much we spent so yeah we'll show you how we budget our trip for a family of five what uh, discount system that we use um, to afford traveling with, five, with uh, as a family of five. We are going to show you how much we spend in each country. I think we are, the plan is, we are going to hit seven countries on this trip, but we'll see, see if anything changes. Um, but I'm so, so excited. We love Southeast Asia. We love it. I'm so excited to show you guys. So don't forget to like, subscribe. Um, 
the first destination that we're going to is Taipei. Um, I have never been to Taipei, so I'm very, very excited. <laughs> She's just excited. Vacation! Cheers for this amazing planner. Thank you, baby. Thank you for planning our trip. He's the, he's the one that budgets everything. Cheers, you guys. Thank you for following along our journey. Yeah. But anyways, Tian does all the booking for like um, airplanes, hotels, and things like that. I do all the activities. Uh, so we kind of divide and conquer. Um, our trip to Taipei for Family Five is actually kind of free. Wow. We pay, our tickets, our tickets free because we use points. How much point per, per person, baby? How much point per person? 37,000. So 37,000 points per person. So that's really, really good from here to Taipei. It's only one way though. Uh, like um, one way, but we have to pay some tax and fees. I think it's about $121 for five of us to Taipei. So that's incredible, you guys. <laughs> uh, you could book through Air France. Mm, yeah. So, okay, so he booked through Air France. But anyways, whatever it is, he did a good job because we only paid 20, $121 for all of us to Taipei. Woohoo! Say, what? what? Whoa! What? The lounge we came in is also free. We use uh, American Express credit. Um, we didn't have to pay for anything and got all that food and drink for free. So it's kind of awesome. We actually, I mean, if you think about it, it's pretty good. Anything it free is good in my book. Usually, <laughs> it's really funny, you guys. When um, Tina's like, hey, how do you want to go somewhere? Then the first thing I say to him is, what do I usually say, baby? Is it free? Is it free? <laughs> is it free? Is it free? Is it free? Is it free? Oh my god, you guys! We are leaving Seattle! Bye, Seattle! Bye. I'm so excited, you guys! We are leaving! They're boarding right now. We're running a bit late, so we're gonna try to walk really fast. You guys, we're like the last person, the last people. See you in Taipei! See you in Taipei! We are here in Seattle and we are going all, all the way to Taipei. Guys, I literally just sat down. They give us drink and then they get us food. Veggie rice and some braised pork. Oh, that's chicken. It's brownie. Yeah, this one it's brownie. brownie. Curry chicken, bean and rice. Oh, like oh, what, what, what is it in here? It's a salad and brownie. But it looks pretty good. Okay, rice. Braised pork. Chinese people known for their braised pork. Try it. Yeah, it's not too bad. Oh, try the curry. We left the end of so picky, you guys, so. I pack this with me, lucky, because she wanted some noodle. She's hungry. <laughs> you hungry, me? It's spicy. <laughs> so we are halfway there? Yeah, halfway. Halfway there, we're like six more hours to go. Snack time, they're giving us pizza. What kind of pizza is that? Pizza twist. Oh, cute. Cheese. Cheese? Let's see. What does it look like? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it is a pizza. Is that a snack? Yeah. We eat pizza, me. 
It's all bread. Hey you guys, snack time. Give us this little pizza. It's pretty cold. Very doughy. A little dry. Good morning, you guys. I took a nap, so is my kid. Okay, so we are almost there. One more hour. Alright, you guys. Here is our breakfast. They have, they have, what is it? Chocolate hazelnut. It's like a like a bread. Hey, they're yeah, like packaging is legit. Oh, it's like a little breading situation. Ah, oh, cute. Good. Music. Oh. Chocolate inside. So here's what I got: the egg and cheese. So, it's pretty hefty. Long bread. Yeah. Good morning, me. Me, we're here. We're here. Oh, we're here. Are you excited? No, we're excited. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Yep, we're here. We landed. Hey, we just got here. So as you exit the airplane, are these like laws? They're like ten years. They, each person needs to get one of these. What is this? Oh, can you read it and see what it is, baby? <laughs> when you arrive to Taipei. Oh, they give you like rules and instructions on what what to so bring and not much to bring. Yeah, so it say no fruits, no pet fruit, no soil, no meat, no no hot dog flowers, no hot dog. Me <laughs> say no hot dog. <laughs> you see hot dog? No hot dog. Yep, that's right. Hams and sausages. So no. Uh, no bacon. No bacon. Oh, good job, Wait, eating. What's this? What is flour? That's flour, B. No flour. Do you have any flour with you? No. Do you have fruit? No. No? Sausage? No. No? Okay, that's right. That's good. We're good. <laughs> Welcome to Taiwan, you guys. We're here. 12, 12 and a half hours later. Actually, the ride was actually really good. The flight is only like, I think, 30% occupancy. So there's tons and tons of room. We pretty much can occupy one role per person. It's pretty cool. Mila had the whole seat for herself. So it's Avery. So we're pretty comfy. The only thing is the food is not that great. Um, I mean, I, I expected a little more, but I was really disappointed. Um, the food is not that great. Um, but other than that, the service was great. Everything was great. Just that um, food wasn't great. U.S. passport. Also, they have U.S. passport and other passports over here. U.S. passport over here. Oh, dang the line. <coughs> a little bit of a line. We made it through immigration like a breeze because we have a shoulder. They have a line for a shoulder, so we didn't have to wait in line. But the other line, oh man, it looks like it's about a good like 30 minutes to an hour wait. Um, so we got really lucky <laughs> and then we also did the immigration card so when you land well actually in seattle um when we checked in they give us a barcode the barcode is like similar to this card right here you guys so we already filled it out when we were in seattle waiting for a plane so we didn't have to fill it out so i would recommend if you come here to taipei fill this thing out before you land um, your airline should give you a barcode that you can just fill it out before you even land to Taipei so that saves you a lot of time and stress. 
Um, but anyway, we're gonna go get our luggage and we are going to figure out how to get to a hotel. We got our luggage, but we don't know how to get out of here. <laughs> Can't find the exit. <laughs> baby, maybe over there? Grab that lady. Hey, why can't we just ask Xander is such a big help. Look, he carried the luggages. We only got like two big luggages for all five of us. And then we got Mila's luggage, but it's all equipment, cameras and stuff like that. We found it, you guys. We found the exit. So you guys, first thing you guys want to do when you get into like a foreign country, hit their ATM. It's that way then you don't have to stress out about it. So we're going to hit our ATM first, get some money. Oh, we got our goods, you guys. Wow, look at this. <laughs> Smell like money. <laughs> Oh, look you guys, they have hotel bus and then they have a bus to the city. So it's pretty, actually pretty convenient. Humid here. Ooh, super, super humid. We just got out. We are doing the bus. Oh man. It's gonna be an hour bus, right? Oh, so we paid $15. Almost $15 for all five of us. That's pretty good. This is where we're staying for five days. Wow, right? Isn't it nice? Wow. Say shit. Bye bye. Put it in my belly. Thank you. Oh, wow. Oh my God, you guys, look at our hotel. We're here. Well, this hotel is nice. It's a nice hotel. It's very grand. Look at that, look at those chandelier, isn't it cool? And they have a little cafe here. Hey guys, we're here, we just checked in. I'm gonna give you a hotel tour really quick. This hotel is super beautiful. The entry, you saw it, oh my god, it's really, really pretty. So it's called the Grand Hyatt in Taipei. Um, so here it is. So as you enter, there is, um, it, Jenna, can you open it and see? What is it? What we, what do we have? Ooh, okay, so we have some ropes, slippers, and a thing for your, your um, luggage. Um, if you were right here, we have some complimentary water up there and then uh, some coffee station. I think that's a refrigerator. Can you open it, Avery, and see okay. what it is? Mm -hmm. Oh, let's see. Yep, it is a refrigerator. And then we have another closet right here. With the money. Where it has like a safe. Is that it? Safe and then some drawers. This is the bathroom. Whoa. Oh my gosh, look. You got a nice fancy bathtub. The kids can soak in. And then look at this big mirror. Hi, hello you guys. Welcome to Taipei. Hola. Hola. Oh my god. So there's more water that they gave us. That's pretty cool. And then, you know, some towels, full of dryers. What else we got? What here? Oh, some, uh, I don't know, body lotion, sh sour cap, you know, all essential stuff. Pretty cool. I, I found something you can do. You got a toilet. Ooh, I love these toilets. Tian loved those toilets. The bidet. <laughs> love I it. it. Love it. Yeah, wash your butt. <laughs> Oh my you god, you it? guys. Shower, look at it. There's a big huge shower head up there. It's This is so cool. And then this is our sh standing shower. Pretty cool. Wait, you can sit here. <laughs> yep, you can sit there. That's right. All right, we're going to move to the bedroom area. So there's a nice little chair. 
And then a TV where my working station, we got beds. Oh, <laughs> is it comfortable? We're like so there, there's that. That's a whole house. Okay, you guys, we are super hungry. It's about 7.30, almost 8 o'clock. Gonna kind of settle in a little bit. We're gonna go try to get food. Um, and yeah, we'll see you in a little bit. Bye! Right, you guys, the men menus are in Chinese. <laughs> so we like had to ask people to help us order. So we ordered three items and it cost about $20, 20 US dollar. Are you excited for noodle, guys? I'm, I have no clue what I order. <laughs> it's gonna be so interesting because I have no clue what I order. But it's fine because uh, we were kind of tired and hungry. We, all I did was I Google mapped it and this is the closest to a hotel. So it's about like a 10 minute walk from a hotel. She's legit. There's some local people here. So we'll see how it goes. Maybe you want to talk? This is the three chines I got. There's uh, some tendons, uh, carrot, veggie. This is the meat. And then I think that's uh, the beef tripes. I think that's beef tripes. And then there's the noodle. Ooh, it smells really good. It's pretty big. I mean, look at this is my hand. It's like two of my hand. That's a dry noodle. Tastes like a dry noodle. Looks really good. Yeah, that's nice. I smell a bean taste too. I like it. You want to try this, baby? You like it? Eat. But I'm surprised there's lots of uh, motorcycle here, huh? Moped here. I guess. But I'm surprised. I I didn't never thought. Lots of people bike here too. Bike, I understand, but motorcycles. I was not expecting it. So you guys, this is our hotel, Grand Hyatt Taipei. And then right next to it is Taipei 101. Pretty, huh? Look at that building, it's tall. Okay, you guys, we just got back from food. I mean, like I told you guys, we were so tired. I literally Google noodles and then just went to the closest one that we, had, uh, we, we found. Um, I mean, it's not that bad. Um, it's okay, I mean, I would give it like a three. Um, three out of five. Mm, I mean the one that Tin ordered the dry noodle is really good the one I ordered is okay I mean it's kind of plain um, anyways we are now back in the hotel trying to settle down but I just want to tell you guys how much how much we spent in this hotel so this hotel initially it cost about $1,200 for five nights but because we have some we have $400 credit from American Express that we use 
so it went down to $800 for five nights, um, which is not bad because we have the first three nights, we have free buffet breakfast for the whole entire family, and then we have $100 credit for food and drinks. So that's really not bad at all. And if you think about it, it's only $160 per night. Um, not, you know, not including all the free stuff that we got. So yeah, it's not bad. But anyway, so for the whole entire Southeast Asia trip this time, you guys, um, we are, we, the, like I said, the plan is seven countries. Um, we'll see where, whether we're gonna make it to all of them. I, I hope so, cause we already booked a lot of them. But anyways, um, we are gonna try to vlog and tell you guys how much exactly how much we spend, what we do to save. Um, so uh, hopefully it help you guys when you guys plan on traveling with your kids. And uh, if you like this video so far, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow us. It's gonna be fun, fun journeys. Only our first day landed uh, landed in Southeast Asia. It's gonna be a long trip, and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye.